hello. Gold lens. So nice brown eyed bat eyeball thing instead. And they take off quite a bit of HP, actually. It's a little bit scary. We're one fight in and I'm nervous already that we're not going to make it through, but we'll do what we can. I think Alice also has some spells to escape any tough fights that we might run into if we desperately need it. So that's always a positive thing. 96 Mesitas, so that's always good news. Okay, so this is locked. So we recently got our dungeon key, which as far as I understand is a reusable key. Perfect. So now we can just take a look around. And what's nice too is we can save at any time in here, rather than always having to worry about running into problems where, you know, you gotta start at the beginning or restore from outside the cave and stuff like that. So I'm gonna try going right first, just to see what's around. Okay, no treasure chest or anything, so that's unfortunate. I'm gonna try to keep my wits about me here. It's, it gets pretty convoluted in these places, I find. And we'll see how well we do maneuvering around here. But hopefully we make it out without dying. We definitely do have some good restoratives though, so we'll definitely not hesitate to use those. I find this game's not a lot like other games where you actually find, um, like, potions and stuff in chests. I find all the chests in this game just give you money, and there's certainly nothing wrong with that, because money seems to be hard to find, but... <laughs> And as I say that, we found a short sword. Okay, well, we didn't really need a short sword, but thanks anyway. Okay. So I think, was this the... this was the way that we came? Yeah. So those stairs go up, we came down, so we want to go left from that area now. So that's a long haul, so let's see where this goes first. I think this is the way that we need to go to continue. Yeah. Oh, hello, werebats. So, we're gonna finish exploring this floor before we continue. Holy jeez, does Alice ever take a lot of hit out of those whereabouts. It's unreal. That weapon upgrade was definitely a good thing. Definitely helpful. And I think Meow eventually will get a weapon as well. It's just a matter of, uh finding it. I don't know where to find a weapon for him or her. There we go. Give me all your mesitas. Okay, let's try this way. Nothing over here. More gold lenses, eh? There's a lot of enemies in this area so far. I gotta keep an eye on everybody's HP as well. I'm still used to playing Miracle Warriors where you can't heal in battle, so I feel like I often let the HP really dwindle before I'm attempting to heal anybody, which is not necessarily a good thing. This was the other way that we needed to check, I believe. And there's a big pile of nothing over here. Okay, so let's head back eventually, and then we'll go to the next floor. I think there's like five or six floors in this place, if I'm recalling correctly, so... I find it harder, you know, the first time you play a game and you don't really know how long or how how much time a place is going to take or how much is left. It's a little bit more stressful when you don't know what to expect and you know you're watching your HP and you're like, are we going to make it? And I think we'll definitely make it out of here without much issue. Oh, an evil dead. Uh-oh. I think we can make it through this fight. These are definitely scary fights. Let's see how it goes here. Treasure chest. How much money do you guys give? Ah, you guys are cheap. 
How are we doing for health here? Maybe we should do a little bit of healing. We'll do meow next. Just for my peace of mind, I guess. And we'll head back to the stairwell. Oh, well then, Mr. Werebat, I guess we're gonna have to deal with you first. There we go. Take that, good sir. Or madam. Alright, next floor. Descending. Into the basement. I love when there's not a lot of options. Not a lot of twists and turns. Okay, this looks like a dead end. Oh, four werebats. This is where Odin's weapon is kind of handy. Because he just slowly chips away at everybody instead of having to really wait for these huge hits or something like that instead. It's kind of nice. Oh, I hate when they burst with strength. It's like they get this surge of power and then they just kick your butt. I remember not long ago when werebats used to terrify me. And now I feel like I can manage them okay. feel a lot like that with a lot of RPGs, where they feel so difficult, you know, and you're like, oh, I can't get through this, I'm not going to make it, this is so hard, and then all of a sudden everything feels really easy. So I guess it's reward for all of the grinding and work that you do in these types of things. This still feels a little bit daunting, though. Oh good, we're gaining levels. Meow learned a new spell, even. What's in here? 252 mosquitoes. Is there a thing back here? No, we just walked into a werebat fight for fun. Okay, this is the next floor, so we also just want to check over here quickly before we continue. More evil deads. We'll take care of them. Kind of look like No Heart from Care Bears, but with a red cloak instead. So, we don't really want to deal too much with those guys. Okay, so let's open this chest and see what's in there. Ten Mesitas. All that work for ten Mesitas. Okay, let's go back then. So I think this was the way... Oh, hello, Werebats. After this, we're going to need to heal again, I think. I think we should be able to make it through okay. It just makes me nervous. I don't really want to have anybody die on me down here. I'd like to know what Meow's new magic is, too. That would be really good to know. I wonder if it's battle magic or if it's... Uh, let's see. Oh, terror. I think you can scare enemies sort of. Like, it's it's like a fear-inducing attack where you can uh, affect them so that they're weaker or something. It's like maybe like a, a defense debuff for the enemy. Maybe. Oh, Odin advanced a level. Gosh, everyone's just leveling up left, right, and center. 189 with he does. Okay, let's do a little bit of Alice magic here. We still have a little bit of MP left on her. And we also have um, some colas and stuff as well, if we need to use those. And let's just save our game, too. We haven't done that in a while. It's always nerve-wracking to save in these places. Gold lens. I wish that we had a, an easier time against these guys. I feel like these are some of the hardest enemies in here. I wish that Odin was a little bit better at dodging. That would also be really convenient. Yeah, it's too bad that we can't, like, heal up the amount of MP, because it would be great to have, like, a restorative measure, or a measure to restore that sort of thing in our people. But we don't have too much further to go, as far as I can recall, but a little bit nerve-wracking. Oh, hello, Evil Dead. 
Oh, really? One HP up? You think that we could have just gotten it? Alice advanced a level. We learned a spell. That's good. I wonder what we learned. What did we learn? Okay, it must be battle. Battle magic that we probably don't have enough H or MP for at the moment. I'm gonna run from this fight. Oh, of course not. Of course. We should have just fought the fight. Look at us. Alice is getting wrecked. Um, you know, I'm gonna cure Alice here. There we go. What do you have? Money, 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 money. Okay, everybody is doing okay, except Meow could use a little drink. I think it's so weird that you give a cat some cola. Use. We'll give that to Odin as well. We do still have a little bit of MP left for Alice, but I don't want to waste it. Okay, so there's also an alternate pathway that we can take to to see where it goes. I wonder if we're getting close to the end here, and that's why this hallway is so long. It very well may be the case. I feel like they always give you like the big grandiose hallway at the end of the thing, and then you get to finally meet the person that you're looking for, or find the item that's there, or something fun like that, so we'll see what's at the end here. Oh good. Look at Odin roasting all the gold lenses. I'm glad nothing's exploded at us yet. A treasure chest? Sure, I'll open it. Thank you. A flash. Good news. Okay, so that wasn't the end. It was just a fun little side quest here. Where we ended up with a new flashlight to replace our old flashlight. Which I'm not complaining about. That's 20 bucks that we just saved. <laughs> it's like the cheapest thing in the game. Why can't you give me like good armor or something? I would certainly welcome that a lot more. It's too bad that Odin doesn't do any magic either. That would be really great. You know, some other form of healing or... I don't know. I'm really glad that we got him a better piece of armor before coming down here, though, or else we would have been in a lot of trouble a long time ago. He'd be dead, let's just be honest. Alice is the total powerhouse of the group, that's for sure. Whereabouts? I'm not afraid of you guys anymore. I like how they pull a little bit of the Samus and they just turn into a little ball for a moment before they wreck you. Kind of funny. But the animations on some of these enemy sprites are just awesome. They do such interesting little things. Like their little hops and... Yeah, it's great. They did a really good job designing these characters. Yeah, we're just rolling in cash right now. It's great. Gold lenses. Oh good, meow. Keep advancing. Be strong, friend. Okay, so we want to go this way, I guess. It's the only other way that we can go. So that looks like it turns. And that also looks like it turns. Let's try this way first. Dead end. So there's nothing here. Oh, whereabouts? Must be the other way. So, how much more magic? Can meow heal Odin? There enough eight MP. Okay, so that's about all the healing that we can really do. So we'll just save here quickly. Because we're at our best game right now. Okay, so this was the other way that we wanted to check. So this should bring us somewhere. Oh, a door. This must be the end. I'm sorry I have a shop in such a place. Shortcake for a thousand mesitas. Sure. Oh, well. Wow. So how much money do we actually have now? Oh, well, we still have about 2,000. Holy crap, that guy has expensive shortcake. 
Alright. Well, it sucks that his shop is way in the boonies here. My goodness. Alright. Let's get the hell out of here. Are we out? Oh, nice. We're out. Okay. Wow. We made it. Save our game. Let's select number four here. Great. Cool. That was great. So let's go back to Motavia now. Oh, tarantulas. Oh dear. These fights are so scary. I hate their little wiggly mandibles. It's not like they do too much damage to you, but they're just such a big sprite. And look at all its eyeballs and... Ugh. And there's also the, the whole you know, paralyzing attack thing. It's a little bit troubling. But what we want to do is get back to Kamini right now, heal up, and then we want to go on a little adventure on our spaceship to go find our new party member. I'm hoping. For a thousand dollar cake, that guy better be impressed. We'll see how, how it goes, I suppose. Okay, so we're out of the woods here, as I get into a fight in the woods, but you know what I mean. We're out of the woods with respect to fighting into that cave now, so that's great. Swarm is killed. Nine Mesitas. It's a pittance compared to what we've been getting here. These fights are awfully refreshing, considering what we were just up against there. Much better. What are you giving me? 52 mosquitoes. I wonder if we're going to have enough money to get all the things that I want. I don't know that we'll have quite enough since we had to spend a thousand dollars on cake. Come on, Odin. You go first. There we go. You don't have to spend so many turns killing things if he just wipes out the low-energy enemies. Oh, really? Okay. Take that, nuisance scorpion. You're dead now. Oh, there we go. Back within the safety of the walls. So let's go in here and heal up. We'll go see Wonderful Swallow for just a moment here. Oh, good. Now let's go to the shop because we've got some cashola's to spend here. Okay, I do want to buy something, thank you. Oh, great, we have enough to buy two shields. We'll get another one of those, please. No. Great. So let's equip our four buddies here. Ceramic shield, we're gonna equip Alice. Great. And then we're gonna equip Odin as well. There we go. Poor guy. Okay. Let's just go to the second hand store quickly. One of my favorite pastimes, of course, in real life with my game collecting. We'll sell our leather shield. Fifteen mesitas, sure. You can have it. No thanks. Okay, let's go take those fun escalators over to the spaceport. Thank you, Boba Fett. Alright. We'll head back up to Motavia and try to go and see this governor. Do I have my passport? Yes. Yes, I do. You made me pay for it, so... What am I gonna do? Alright. So here we go. All those ant lions. Jeez, there's so many of them. 
gosh, they weren't kidding when they said that these lands were under martial law. You gotta talk to a guy whenever you want to do anything. I don't really want permission. Alright, let's go in here. So we can use our dungeon key on this lock as well. Nice yellow. Do you have a present to give to the governor? Yep. I'll take the shortcake now. Good. Hope you like my thousand dollar gift. Robot man. Oops. Alright. Check out this little house first. Please rest your weary bones. I am praying for your safety. Okay. We'll save our game here. Just because I don't know that we've saved in a little while. Just to be on the safe side. Okay. Go in the house here. Oh, hey. I'm the governor. I'm told that you intend to try to kill Lassik. I admire your courage. In the Maharu Cave lives an Espar named Noah. I will give you a letter of introduction to present to her. I have faith that you will kill Lassik and return here eventually. You should rest here a while after your long journey. You fell into a deep sleep. Uh, a succubus, eh? Okay then. Now, we have some magic. I don't know if this is gonna help. What does Meow have? Terror and Cure. So we'll try attack. See how this goes. This is a really weird... Oops. Really weird fight. And I don't know if it's gonna work out in our favor, if we're actually gonna be able to make it. I wanna see how much Alice does in terms of attack as well. well Alice does a big chunk. Oh god. Um we're gonna attack, we're gonna cure with with poor Meow. Oh my goodness, what is this even? Succubus dodges Alice's attack. Well, then we're just gonna spam you with magic. And meow, you're gonna heal yourself. Because you're hurting pretty bad. I have no idea... ...what this fight even is. Or if we can even win this fight. I wonder if we can win this fight if we're strong enough when we get here. We might have a chance. Hard to say. Oh, I don't have any MP. I guess I can't. It's attack for everybody. See how it goes. I have a feeling we're gonna die, though. Stop dodging me. Just die, please. Alice cannot move. Come on, man. She's in a powerhouse. <gasps> Meow died. Uh-oh. Well, Odin still has a lot of spunk left, but he's kind of useless. Oh dear. Goodbye, Odin. Alice cannot move. Alice has one hit left. Alright then, Alice died. Holy jeez. You had a bad dream. No kidding. I have faith that you will kill Lassic and return here eventually. What was that even? Like, what just happened? Alright, well, I guess the next place that we need to go is up to find Noah, wherever she lives. Apparently Noah is a girl, so let's go and do that. Oh, hello. I turn a corner and there you are, waiting for me. I like how you shoot the enemy right in its face. Like when, when Odin shoots his gun, it's like right in the enemy's face. Like right in the eyes. I don't know why that's so funny to me. It's great, though. It does the job, that's for sure. Ah! Arrow? Spear? Come on now. 